you're looking for something that ticks all of the boxes, 21 Mulberry Lane in Bellevue is certainly one that ticks more than just the boxes of any ordinary home. Uh, Karen Wills, Barry Friedheim, well, they've been the resident agents helping you find a new residence uh, here uh, this afternoon, uh, assisting you in all of your due diligence. Uh, the property, well, it is legally described as an estate and freehold. That describes the nature of ownership in the land underpinning the investment here. It's the highest form of ownership that you can have of land in New Zealand as a private resident or citizen. It is uh, described as 1,072 square metres of some of the best soils you'll find anywhere, evidenced by the uh, wonderful orchards and citruses uh, throughout the gardens of this uh, particular property. It is lot 6, depositor plan uh, 64795, all uh, in record of title SA52B, folio 9. You do bid and buy today with vacant possession. You get to choose who stays and for how long. And certainly here, ladies and gentlemen, with the two residents, the two dwellings on the one site, it does give so many options in regards to the purchaser or purchases in regards to uh, how you're going to distribute those guests or more permanent residents, family and friends. Uh, the settlement and possession date, well, that's the date you get to choose all of those things, subject to being the purchaser here today, paying your 10% deposit. And that is Thursday, the 22nd of July. So not too long to wait now, and you can be moving in and enjoying this absolutely stunning location. In regards to the chattels, will they remain unchanged from the contracts you have received? Those are included in your bid price here today, and certainly, ladies and gentlemen, I can understand the reason for the interest we hold. Very, very rarely do you get uh, two residences uh, connected within the first, same property uh, within this location. Situated in certainly one of the most sought after locations within uh, Taunaia. A wonderful schooling, literally a hop, skip and a jump nearly. I was there at the property the other day and literally saw the kids walking up the cul-de-sac past the property, uh, hop, skipping and jumping. They were so happy to be out of school. It was at the end of the day. Uh, but I thought to myself, gosh, wouldn't it be wonderful for those kids? They'd already be home by now. If they lived here, it is so convenient uh, and so well located to the local schools. Uh, as you can see from the uh, aerial shot here, uh, a plethora of space around the home, including accommodation for the RV, uh, maybe other vehicles, but also uh, a massive space uh, for additional parking right throughout uh, the property, including at 21A, which is included here. The property running down and through these established grounds, wonderful large trees, and the home sitting elevated, so that as we swing that camera around and we see uh, this corner here, you really are at a canopy level, but with very level access into the home itself. Itself. Great entertaining here, and the two dwellings being so separate and so private. Stepping inside doesn't disappoint either. Uh, wonderful entertaining from that open, plain kitchen, dining, massive spaces here, very, very large home indeed. And I know that families that stay together, play together, but sometimes have separation are very healthy families. So ladies and gentlemen, a home here that certainly does accommodate uh, for all of your needs, both uh, close and far. Uh, let's swing the camera around once again, and you can see here again, a very generous sized uh, kitchen here that flows into that dining, and then as we go through and into the living, it does uh, obviously give you just a little bit of size and scale, as we see the next shot there, Vanessa, of uh, the uh, living, Again, those wonderful picture windows are uh, taking in the elevated views uh, of the uh, canopy there. The home itself, as I started by saying, does have uh, wonderful parking, as you'll see here in just a moment, uh, right underneath down into 21A, also underneath uh, 21, and then also, as you can see here, enough room for the larger uh, vehicle accommodation requirements. Ladies and gentlemen, end of a cul-de-sac, close to schools, uh, two dwellings, it really should tick all the boxes. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, where would you like to start the bidding? I'm in your hands. Uh, certainly, I know we hold interest, it's just a matter of how much and to who. Pardon me? 900. 900, welcome into the bidding. Like to see it the end too, sir. 900, welcome in. At 900,000, sorry, at 900. And two, sorry, we do have two phone bidders. They'll be exercised by Matthew and Miriam, is that right? Thank you. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, at 900,000, we're underway now. How about we take $50,000 bids just to move us along? At 900,000, 50, do I see bidding? At 900,000, clearly bid here and welcome in. Sorry, just took it at the back at 950, but you can be a million if you like. And what he says, one million the bid now, bid to the front here to the right. At one only, one million and fifty over if you wish. At one million and fifty, one million and fifty now, to the back and one one. One point one the bid now, bidding at 100 on the million now, take another 50 from here if you will, and 50 back with 
of our starter. 115 now, 1 1.2 if you wish, and 1.2. 1 million 200,000 a bit now, good considered bidding as I'd expect. Hit 1 million 2 and 50 surely. Hit 1 million 2, how about your 25? Hit 1 million 200,000 bidding once now at 1 and 25. 1, 2 and 25 and a quarter. 1 and 250 now. 1 million 250,000. Isn't it great? You see your competition. Great real estate, very rarely bought easily. At 1 million 250. Bids in front here, literally, at 1 million 2 and 50 and 75. Next of you and 75. 1, 2, 7, 5 and 3, straight back. 1 million 3, don't be put off by the pace. At 1 million 3. Got to be last to win. At 1 million 300,000. You're all welcome to join in at any stage, by the way. At 1 million 3. Bidding. At 1 million 3. Why would you do here? Pardon? Is that on your overdraft? <laughs> at 1 million 3. Bidding. Done. At 1 million 3 and 25. 1, 3 and 2, 5 now. 1 million 3, 25. How about tens? You've been there all the way. At 1 million 325 to the back of the room and in front. At 1 million 3, at 25, 35 surely. 1 million 325 once now. At 1, it's your bid, sir. 1 million 325. Instructions work harder. At 1 million 325. Bidding once. You're welcome to increase your offer though. At 1 million 325. <laughs> Just trying to help and send you home happy. At 1 million 325. Bidding once at 1 million 325. Looking for 35 now. Twice at 1 million 3 and 25. Third, final time at 1 million, 325. Barry, I think we're going to just need to get some instructions. We're not too far away, but I am just going to pause here. No, I can't put you out of uh, your suspense yet. We'll be back in just a moment. May need to have a quick chat with our highest bidder also. Please deal with us. Well, thank you, ladies and gentlemen. It's uh, lovely to have the air conditioning turned down a little bit to get a bit of cool air in the room. But uh, enough cool air, hot air about to kick in at 1,350,000, which the bid has been raised to. We're on the market, we're selling. At 1,350,000, it sells today. New owners will be found. Don't be slow. At 1,350,000, going to tempt you back in now. At 1,350,000, we sell away. I call it three times before we sell. At 1,350,000, once now, and it's selling away twice. At 1,350,000 bits here. Third, final time, it is selling. It is selling. Sold, congratulations.